So who has to do the udhiya or qurbani and where can it be done? Well, from an Islamic perspective, alhamdulillah, you know, the udhiya is something that the scholars consider to be a sunnah of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, more specifically known as a sunnah mu'akkada. A sunnah that a person is able to perform or to carry out for themselves and their entire household. And this can be done either by the mother or by the father or by someone in the household that has surplus wealth. Wealth that is not needed to be used specifically to look after the family. So for example, if a father is the one who's going to be carrying out the udhiya or qurbani, then if he's not able to financially look after his family, then he's not required to sacrifice the animal or have the animal sacrificed for his family. But if he is, then he can do that and it's a sunnah mu'akkadah of the Prophet Now can this be done elsewhere or should it be done locally? It is preferred if it's done locally. However, if there are people on earth or in other cities, other towns, other countries that are in dire need and are suffering more than we are or are hungry more than we are, then it is permissible Islamically to have that animal sacrificed in another country or have the animal sacrificed here because the sunnah is to actually sacrifice the animal yourself if you're able to and then send the meat to wherever it is needed the most. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows best. Jazakumullah khairan.